Hello everyone, I'm Hair and Mocha Lover, joined here with my cat, Hair Binky. So, we are currently surrounded on all sides. We have the Pact of Rome to the west and south of us, and then we have the common turn to the mostly east of us. So, last time I told you that I wanted to try a small social experiment on YouTube, and as a very tiny content creator, if you could get demonetized for saying the word Nazi, um, but so far I've not yet been demonetized, at least that episode or this episode yet, as of Monday, December 16th, 2019. But you never know what 2020 or 2021 might hold, so I'll let you know what goes on. But anyway, anyways, we are currently preparing for conflict with the Hungarians. They want Southern Slovakia, yet I am trying to align them to us. Yeah. This is getting weird. It's getting weird. Very, very weird. We have enough political power so that if I needed to, I could raise conscription. But I'm not fascist, I'm not communist, and I'm not in a war currently, which is no bueno. Anything here that'll help me out with defense or anything? We're, I mean, we're out of manpower. If they attack me, especially Hungary or Austria, my line isn't very strong. We might be able to take one tile off of the... Austrians, maybe? Not really sure. Maybe, maybe not. Ooh, good, 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 good. Let's, let's build a few things here first. Um, this is all just precautionary stuff. And when you're done with that, keep doing... That's good. Uh, that's Luxembourg. Level 3 forts, especially over river, should be okay. Do that. But then most definitely start building up these areas around here. I know, it's kind of, sometimes some would consider it a waste to build forts, but given my situation, I might need it against the common turn. Especially with the UK and the Allies basically doing absolutely nothing. You okay, Bink? Yeah? Alright, yeah, I know. I don't like... Yeah, I know. I don't like the fascists to the south and the uh, west, or the communists to the east. Why doesn't anyone want to be d democratic? I don't understand. Let's get some forward observers anyways, though. More reinforcement and reconnaissance. I should have probably stayed with mobile warfare doctrine to get desperate defense, to be honest with you. But my decision has been made. Oh, well. Uh, intervene in the Romanian Civil War. Please do not have a Romanian Civil War unless the Russians, the Soviets are demanding Bessarabia. Then just go ahead, have a civil war, and get kicked out of my faction. I will be happy with you. Uh, let's see right now. Anything here? Really? Not very much. I'm just waiting for more stuff. Just... Oh, wait. We want Fritz Todd. Democracy. We're already getting democracy support and more power gain with that. Let's get Fritz Todd. 20% land port construction speed, which I think is worth it. Especially for us, 20% on some of these tiles. Very, very important. I mean, just look at that. Look how many divisions are around here. Holy cow. You okay, Bink? Just my goodness gracious. Ah, atomic research. Very nice. Those will come in handy if we can produce enough planes and bombers and get air superiority. It's 1940. Let's get some of this stuff. We're going to need some more defense. Uh, we have probably about 11 days, and then they have, uh, how much further? 11 days to 10 days. Ooh. 9 days. Oh, we're gonna do it right at the same time. Come on. Come on, hungry man. I thought we were friends. I thought we were allies at one point. Well, kind of, kind of not. We've got a good stockpile of stuff. I'm also trying to make some more heavy tanks, which actually are tanks. Some of them are kind of heavy. Beautiful. Really beautiful. Alright, well, we'll see what happens when this fires. Hungary demands southern Slovakia. Following up on their vows to redress the Treaty of Tri Trianon, Hungary has demanded the return of southern Slovakia from Czechoslovakia. The Czechoslovakians have not yet responded, but the threat of war and Hungarian rhetoric is all but too clear. Rejection may well lead to a new war in the region. Peacefully? No, let's go to war. Screw that. Go to war. Ooh, what is this? If Hungary is in a faction with Germany, add four military factories to both, and Hungary becomes a puppet. I propose to Romania, they become a puppet of us. 
that's not bad. We might want to wait. We might be able to do a little sneaky, sneaky, sneak and um, boost ideology in Hungary. That might be actually something good we could do. Let's get some army innovations next. The lessons learned at our facilities in the USSR will allow us to further improve our doctrines and equipment. However, this time we will keep the advances to ourselves. <clears throat> Hope y'all are ready for war because I am not. Bombers, good. What are you going to do, Hungary? I mean, you're old. No! Don't! Why'd you give it up? No! They've accepted Hungarian demands? No, no, no. You're just appeasing them. That was a waste. That was an absolute waste. You made us weaker. Oh, God. Come on, man. Come on. Oh, God. The fascists are getting ready to go to war with us. This is not good. Ah. Uh... Can I get Turkey to join the fascists or the communists? That would help me out so much. Civil War. You know what? Claim lordship over Slovakia. See, if you give in to their demands, they're only going to demand more. But let's try the sneaky. Let us, as a very good democratic nation, begin boosting uh, party popularity in the good old Hungarian nation. Uh, daily democracy support is looking good. We've got interventionism, which is good. They are increasing their popularity of democracy support by 0.15, which isn't bad. Let's get some more construction stuff, because I could repair stuff f faster or really build up these fort lines quite a bit more. Uh, why'd you give that up? That was a good defensive line. You lost a few forts down here as well, which means it's even harder for us to attack into there. Uh, at least the Soviets are doing anti-capitalist diplomacy for now. France is doing caste focus. They got a lot of... They, everyone has so much more manpower than me. What are you doing, UK? You're doing nothing. United States? War plan white. Guys, can you do something? Um, Guys, please. Uh, do they have a focus against me? They might. I'm sure they do somewhere here. Global hegemony. Man, they already did the Manhattan Project. Wow, they they really want to go to war fast. Huh. I, and I'll let you know right now, I can't justify on Poland. Oh, yeah, become more democratic, please. Yeah, I can go to war with Poland if needed. I can justify on them, so that's pretty good. Um, I can just I can go to war with the Soviets right now, but that wouldn't be very good. Not aggression pact with those guys. Romania. If I were to go to war with the Soviet Union, could I get the fascists to allow them to pass through my territory? That would be interesting. I can also go to war with the fascists if I want to myself. But we're going to try something first. We're going to see if we can get Hungary to actually join our faction instead. At least become democratic. And then maybe with my focus, I can still puppet them. I'm trying to avoid war as long as possible, if you can't tell. Like, I don't want a two-front war. my Because I need manpower. I need more manpower so I can get tanks. That's the main thing. I need tanks and an air force. I mean, these divisions holding out here, I mean, they're all right. They'll do okay. They're not great. They're not bad. But they're not great. Um, let's get Kurt Student to be a field marshal. And go ahead and do defensive doctrine. You're going to have to defend, defend, defend. Holy cow. <clears throat> even with level 5 forts. And even better stuff there. Like, you're going to need it. you really going to need it. Um, infrastructure would be nice. Don't really need it that much, though. Uh... I'm glad we got forts over here. If we need more forts, we're going to build up Königsberg. Alright, so. The Hungarian would approach us with an offer to divide Czechoslovakia. We would get the western parts of the country, while Hungary would get most of Slovakia, with the demarcation, demarcation line between our countries roughly bisecting the country. They have assured us that as long as we get their... As long as they get their share in the end, they are willing to let us make the first move. Uh, Conrad... Ooh, that is hard. That is hard to say. Claims lordship. Army innovations, too. I, we want to be democratic as much as possible. Um, They are willing to let us make the first move. Oh, I don't like that wording very much. I'm trying to be democratic. 
And the Czechs? Well, the Czechs aren't bad people. They're good people. They have a little bit of manpower. But I need manpower, too. But they got quite a few divisions. Would they be better under me or Czechoslovakia? Um, I don't want to go first. You know what? No. They get nothing. I'm not going to risk Czechoslovakia. And we're going to wait for this, of course. Let's go ahead and get something else. Well, let's see. Shared R&D program. For the good of our cause, we must pool our scientific knowledge and share our technological advances with our new allies. Of course. We only get 1.03 political power a day. Let's go ahead and increase the democracy gain here if we can as well. That would be lovely. Quit India movement. Ooh, very interesting. Hung Germany rejects Hungarian demand. Stone-headed fools. With tensions running high, more and more observers are wondering if Hungary might resort to violence. Come on, Hungary. Do it. Do me dirty. I won't be able to hold Belgium, probably. Oh, hello, Denmark. You realize that there's a threat on our borders? And you're sending divisions? Ah, oh, you sent a division to Luxembourg. Beautiful. Arado, very nice. 1941. If you can't tell, I'm a little cold right now. It's when I'm recording this. It's kind of cold outside, so. Oh, come on, hungry. Do something. Do something. Proclaim Greater Hungary with the Austro-Hungarian flag. Okay, then. That's still very, very disgusting. Uh, do I go to press war? Do I not press war? I kind of want to go to war, though. I'm kind of tired of waiting around. What's the UK doing? Why we fight... You are going towards a liberty ethos. Huh. Oh, there we go. Don't engage immediately, guys. Uh, well, I guess we're at war. Cool. And I can immediately go to extensive conscription. That's the first thing I have to do. And if they're going to attack... Germany under attack. I'm under attack. Not long ago, Germany found itself dragged into another war while everyone had hoped for a long-lasting peace in Europe. It's clear that the tensions on the continent are still too great. German officials state that they can no longer afford to keep the Rhineland demilitarized, arguing that they need full mobility within their own borders to order to defend themselves. Oh, we no longer get bulwark against Bolshevism. Oh, crap. This isn't good. Uh, oh, I want forts. I'm going to need a lot of forts. Just in case the low countries fall. Uh, this is good. This is good. I really don't want to attack unless we have guaranteed success somewhere. But if the tanks can do well, let them have it. Let them rip. I guess I'm not ripping too hard. Alright, well, whatever. If you can win there too. If we can have strategic attacks where we can win successfully, I don't mind attacking. We must remember, though, I really only have infantry on my divisions. Did they push me in already? No. I thought they did. Okay. Whew. That actually might make more sense if I coordinate these attacks a little bit better. Yeah, let's go ahead and coordinate them. Uh, everyone come right there. Well, we're at war again. We've lost less than a thousand. Hungary's lost quite a few uh, because they already were in a war. Colonies have lost some. I'm here to help hold the line if things don't go well. Romania, just go ahead and use up your manpower. I don't feel bad if you do that. Help them out. Help them out wherever we can. Good. It says in general we would have a good push, but I just don't have the manpower. I don't want to weaken myself too much. Now, if anything, you all can come to Vels. They shouldn't be able to pierce us. Oh, they can a little bit. Dutchies Indies are in the war. Nice. Yeah, guys, communists. Yeah, non-aggression pact. Yeah, that sounds good to me. Yeah, communists, please don't kill me. we got to take out the fascist threat first. I'm going to try to make an encirclement with these tanks, though. Something small, nothing too large. Uh, focus on taking this and then that. That should be good enough for a very, very tiny, 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 tiny encirclement. Romania's pushing well, as I'm trying to make sure that they become more and more democratic. They're fighting for democracy. 
Good. <clears throat> Good. And you immediately go this way and you just stay there. Tanks, how are you doing? You are pushing in very, very well. Can I do that and then move you this way as well? That would be amazing. Uh, Hungary isn't doing well. Our attacks are maybe not doing as well as we might hope, perhaps. If you help attack, could you win? If you help attack, could you win as well? You might be able to, which is good. Very, very extremely strategic attacks. Losses. 44,000. Italy's lost quite a few to Republican Spain. Nation. F oh, wait, hold on. They're not attacking us over here. Good. We have too many infantry to, that won't get destroyed, which is good, good, good. Do not move. I need you to kill all these guys off so we can make a, maybe a small encirclement here. Come on. You guys got this. Your tanks. Your even though you're only light tanks, you're still tanks. Attack here if you can. Oh, you might not be able to. Succeed. Yeah, you might win. Yeah, I hope so. I think we all hope so. At least most of us. Oh, the infantry or the tanks are faltering a little bit. Oh, we got plenty in reserve though. We got plenty of stuff in reserve. We have. I need to make some screens. Light cruisers. Have at the Vesserams. We need more chromium. Oh god, no. Naval Bomber 2. I forgot about you. Yeah, I forgot about that. Um, yeah, do that. That'll be important. You guys are fine. You guys are fine. Fighter 2s. We're going to need more. More. Take off. Those five. Good. Oh, uh, the tanks are okay. The tanks are holding okay-ish. Infantry, you haven't done that great. Great. Ah, Friedrich Schulz is injured. Oh, actually, did I? Am I not? I'm not even using an air force yet. Oh, that's that's a big no-no. You know what? If I want to be successful at least in one location, just send them all to one guy. All right. It looks like we can't make an encirclement there. Our soldiers are dying like crazy. Just hold on to your positions. That's all I'm going to ask. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Are we getting attacked in the Low Countries? What are you doing? Why? No, 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 no. Belgium, no. Aggression towards France, not good. You will not win. I guarantee you. Uh, let's get let's get some of that. Those tax are now are starting to kind of falter, which isn't good whatsoever. I would love to attack this position, but there's way too many divisions over here. It looks like I'm going to need some radar so I can see what's going on. They still have attacked me here, though. That's good to know. Um, yeah, casualties. They're probably not looking too good. That's quite a few. It's not bad. Italy. Oh, what the heck? Oh, goodness gracious. Um, sacrifice everything if you have to. To get rid of these guys. Just, I tried to make an encirclement. It didn't go as well as, or as well as I hoped or planned. Yeah, if, I'm going to probably lose these guys, to be honest with you. Yeah, that's that was crazy. How did they get taken out that fast? That makes no sense. Oh, there goes the tanks. I'm going to lose these guys. Yeah, I'm going to lose them. What do they have even here? Well, I'm going to lose them. So, do that. I'd rather do that than completely lose them. So, back to the drawing board. Democratic Germany, not super easy. Go ahead and do that. We'll leave in one light tank because I don't have the production I need for them. So, it looks like it's going to be an extremely defensive war here. Stupid fascists. You kill off much of my own manpower. Well, at least they're only light tanks. They weren't extremely, extremely important. Uh, go ahead and help them out. I don't want to see these fascists here. Oh, help them out here, too. What do they have? They have there's only six divisions. You know what? Everyone hold. Cancel. Just hold. Just hold. You'll be all right. Actually, if anything, reorganize the line since we might be able to do this a little bit better. Do that. That's good. That's good. Um, I don't want to do this right now in the middle of battle. I'm gonna throw on one of these bad boys. Low less HP, low less organization, more soft attack. That'll be good with me. And we have enough equipment to do that. And we get a little bit chunk more manpower. Good. Let's get advanced fire bases. 
Fascists. Oh, fascists. Yeah, we're going to have one heck of a defensive war against these guys. Romania did really, really well in the beginning here. Holy cow, that was really good by them. Um, you are really, really reorganizing this. What is, what's going on? Why are you banning the line? Hold on. Wait. Oh my goodness, that's because... That's not good. Oh, I see, because... You got Slavia here with, is with... There's some... Commenter nations here. Holy cow. Was not expecting that. Let's go ahead and grab some more artillery. We're going to need all that stuff. No wonder I can't defend down here, because Yugoslavia is back alive in some locations. Hungary proclaims greater Hungary. All right, all right, all right. Well, it'll be weird once they switch to democracy, if you know what I mean. Ooh, this will help. So, pool technical know-how. Every nation has their own methods of managing industry and maintaining equipment. We can learn from each other by sending technical teams to dis disseminate this knowledge among the other members of the alliance. This will help them, which is good. Go ahead, get reorganized, defend Austria, defend against France, because they will be going to war with us soon. Japan? What the heck? Oh, Japan, you're ugly as all sin. Southern resource area. Do I have... Oh, they're going to declare one of the Dutch East Indies, who's my ally. Well, oh well. Oh well. Hmm... Can I get that yet? No, I cannot. Tanks. I definitely want those mouse tanks. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Um, do that, I guess. I mean, it really doesn't matter too much. Guys, why do you have to attack like crazy? That's not a smart idea. Just defend the homeland. Guys, Belgium, no! Because you guys... Oh, wait. Hold on. Hold on. Hold the phone. Why are you over here? You guys should be up here. If anything, yeah. Paulus? This is much better now. That should be much, much better. Uh, yeah. I don't know why there's another line here, though. This makes no sense. Just get rid of it. We'll, re we'll redo it. That's fine. There you go. Much more concentrated. Much better. Even though I'm going to leave these guys here. Good, good, good. Just hold the line for now. Um, if you could win here, that'd be great. If possible. Uh, Italians, though. Oh, my goodness. I can't believe we're fighting on the same side as communists. It's crazy. Absolutely crazy. Oh, can you actually... No, 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 no. Just stay there, stay there. No, don't move. Can we win here? Can the communists win here? I don't mind fighting with communists if they'll help me take out the fascists. I think I've seen that before. Hmm. Sounds a little historical. But, oh well. Thank God I put forts here. Oh, that was important. Oh my goodness. Forts are important. Okay, so we're losing. Alright, we can't move at all. Good to know. Good to know. Infantry is very, very weak. Ah. Uh, well, let's go look at losses. So we've only lost 43,000. That's not bad. We've got quite a few guys in reserve, which is good. Though, uh, our allies, Czechoslovakia, has lost a quarter million. Romania has lost way too many. Belgium has lost way too many. Comintern, frankly, keep going. Keep going, Comintern, keep going. I, I love your progress of, on how you're doing stuff. I think you could serve as a good role model for everybody. Let's go and deploy some more planes, because we're going to need them. Uh, you immediately go ahead and go to here. Do that. Do I have any other planes? Just carrier stuff. Oh boy. That's all I want you to do is hold for now. Alright, next up, you guys just all come to him. I don't even know which one you are. You're right there. Okay, that, that actually makes sense. They don't like attack. Oh, they like attack me a little bit. Oh, that's not. Good. I have a very tiny, 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 tiny navy compared to everyone else. Uh, you guys, come here. And then we have no other spare ships, which really sucks. Really, really, really sucks. 
Patrol right there. Low engagement, you never know if you might find the French Navy. Because even though you really don't think of the French Navy, they're still kind of powerful, at least a little bit. So, it's good to keep those guys in mind. Alright, you're continuing to attack here like crazy, but I'm okay with that if it's mostly just Soviet divisions doing their thing. Soviets. Looking good, looking good. Poland. They haven't sent any divisions, which is fine with us. We're still building more things. Let's go ahead and build some more refineries. We're going to need them. Uh, let's build them in Ostmark. Wherever we build them, they're getting they're pretty close to getting attacked. I mean, they get, get attacked by France, getting attacked by the Soviets. You know, just normal things. Do I have a stockpile of... Oh, I do have another stockpile of heavy tanks. Good. Just do that. Okay. Did I forget to train them? I think I did. Yeah, I did. God dang it. I do not remember what I was doing in this campaign whatsoever, was I? Well, as long as now we have super, we just have heavy tanks. Which isn't bad. I could use mechanized. Their armor's pretty good. China has capitulated. That in itself isn't good. Throw you over here. I'm gonna need you over there still. Uh, Winter Expert. I could. Go ahead and train, though, all of you guys, since you're kind of green. Well, China, you had a chance. My two goes down there. Very sad. Very, very sad. Good. I get about 0.67 political power a day. You're good enough. Don't train anymore. Prepare yourselves. You never know. How close is Hungary to becoming a democracy? They're still getting about 0 0.08 a day. Not bad. Ah, another one. Good. Actually, I'm going to throw you over here. Smoke generators, not bad. 1941. Ah, the struggle is real. Good. Soon enough, we shall have... Ooh, you guys can win. Yeah, go ahead. And circle these bad boys over here. Yeah, if we... Oh, thank goodness. Go ahead and immediately begin attacking. Screw these guys. You killed my tanks off. You eight divisions are going to suffer the same fate. And these are eight divisions in here instead of our five or six uh, tank divisions that were destroyed. Um, good. Another division. Awesome. Just awesome. Assembly line production. Awesome. 1941. We're going to need more fuel. Always, always, always going to need more fuel. Ah, uh, that was beautiful. We actually, actually at least killed them off. That was good. It's kind of sad when we've killed off the most Italians compared to everyone else. Or Hungarians, I mean. Yeah. The Republic and Spain did take out a few Italian boys. That's good. Support companies. <clears throat> Excuse me. Sure, we'll do that. Why not? You guys come over here. That'd be great. And they are attacking us like crazy. Friedrich Schultz. Yes, please. Any upgrades? No, not yet. Is France attacking us yet? No. And that's fine with me. <clears throat> oh, are they actually broke through? No. Okay. I thought they did initially. Good. They haven't. And they're still attacking me like crazy. Oh, look at Czechoslovakia. <clears throat> Excuse me, their strength is so low. That's really not good. Democratic Bastion. I like that, though. Good. Don't go right. Don't go left. Just stay in the center and become a democracy like everyone else. That's right. Peer pressure, everyone. Peer pressure. More population. Oh, they could really use that. Czech Technical University. Nice. Good, 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 good. What is the Italian and French manpower like? Oh, I love extensive conscription. Uh, half a million? The French are a little less than half a million. Interesting. Oh, we've not engaged anyone around here, which is good. What if I did convoy raiding and increase that? That would be bueno. Oh, if we could get Budapest, that would be amazing. Yes, commies, yes. Sacrifice yourselves. What if we helped you out? You might be able to win here. What are the losses for the common turn? Good. I'm liking it. Full technical know-how that helps everyone in our faction. Good, good, good. The Mannheim Project. With heavy water, we might want to do that. Let's do a Danubian expansion. We must seek to expand our influence to those Balkan nations prone to Soviet aggression. We shall offer them the remaining nations in the Danube membership and protection against the threat of communism. Um, Yugoslavia, you could, I guess, join me. I mean, it, I guess it doesn't really matter since you're kind of dead already. So, hey, but if you join... Okay. Japan declared war in France. I'm okay with this. 
this is great. Just don't go to war with me. Or the Dutch East Indies, because we still need them. I'm glad they went to war with the French first. That actually is really good for distraction. Seven divisions here. Throw you over here. Throw one more. Boom. Good. This area needs it. Needs the most divisions first. Three divisions. Go ahead and help out. Nice. Nice. We actually have divisions we can throw at the line. Thank the Lord. Oh, goodness. Oh, but the Soviets are looking so intimidating. I'm probably going to lose Prussia. No matter what I do. Oh, man. Oh, we got the mouse, though. We have the mouse. Yes. And actually, 64 days. I want the one that gives you a ton of soft attack. Look at that. 85 soft attack. Everything else sucks. Defense, breakthrough. Armor actually isn't bad. A 210 millimeter artillery gun. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that. That's a fat boy. Oh, I love it. Oh, my goodness, yes. Oh, oh goodness gracious. Yes, yes, yes. Look at that. Oh, it's so heavy. I love my big boys. Make only one of these ba bad boys. Um, yeah, do that. Or I forget. Oops. No logistic company, that's okay. Uh, go ahead and convert these. Oh, yeah. Can I give them more speed? Slightly, slightly more speed. Do that. For now. Over time, I'll continue to upgrade these guys, but we can start making our mouse tanks. We have dispersed industry. Let's go grab some more rubber, because we're probably honestly going to need that if we don't need that already. We have taken Budapest, or our ally really has. That's amazing. That's really, really awesome. I don't believe that we can really strike into Austria too well right now. They're out of manpower. Ooh. Italy. Half a million. France, of course, about 300,000 some. If I attack, that wouldn't be very good for us. Oh my goodness, why are you putting boys in the water? Italy's having a field day with your guys. Oh, boys, 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 boys. Cool. Can I get any more boys in the air? I got one. Well, we've got one. One is better than none, I guess. Hungry. What's the manpower of Hungry? They can't have that much manpower left. No, they're on all adult serve, which is good. There's 12 divisions here. I want the communists to continue attacking. And they are. Goodness gracious, you really are attacking until you're all dead. I love it. I absolutely love it. And you have more communist guys down here as well. Oh, goodness. But let's take a quick look before we're done. Becoming more and more democratic. Good. I might be able to stage a coup. There goes third Guangxi clique was puppeted. Ah, good. Kick from faction. I don't think I'm going to do that. Demand transnist. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, 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 no. We can't do that. Oh, actually, that's not bad. Why? Why do you do this, though? Why do you do this? No. No, 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 no. I'm going to call an audible here. No. That's disgusting. Just, no. That's one thing if it's just Communist China in their little region of Communist China, but why would you do that? Just give it to the, give it to the Japanese. There you go. That's okay if it's like that, but everything else, no, 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 no. That's disgusting. Oh, my goodness. There's really no way I can push until I have my tanks, my super special tanks. Oh, my goodness. It takes so long to produce them, though. If I tried to attack, I would get nowhere either. So, it's pretty much turned out to be kind of like World War One, where no one's going to move unless someone has a big old metal boy on the field. Unless you're the Soviets and you're just constantly attacking like crazy. Which we're okay with. So, hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. I know I did. I was concerned that we weren't going to be able to go to war, but we have. And we might be at war with the communists next time. I don't know. But we'll see what happens. Thanks for watching, guys, though. Leave a like if you liked the video. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link below. And I will see you tomorrow as we watch the results of this renewed attack. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.